reading my mind. How did you know? Huh? What is it? 15%? Is that a trick question too? You guys want to know something? We're all going to be able to deduce the answers you, you know, looking at these pictures. You know that? But what starts to happen in the future is people will start going, oh, what is the answer to this? I don't know. It's, it's interesting. How did, you, how did you deduce that this was 15%? How do you know that, yes, that is 15%? How do you know that? Oh, so you're telling me, you're telling me that this whole thing, you're saying, wait a minute, if this whole thing is what? 50. And that goes forever, right? Because the tail, you're saying if that's 50, that you subtracted what? 35 and got 15? Is that true? How about if I do it this way? When some people look at this, they, they have a hard time seeing that it's 15. Some people do. Because there's a certain amount of, we all have certain, I think it's called spatial intelligence, you know. How about if I do this? Call that x percent because you don't know it. You okay with that? Would you guys agree if I said this to you? That if I take the 35 and I add it with what? This part plus this part, which is x, what should it equal? 50. You guys okay with that? This portion here plus this portion should be what? 50. Could you solve for x? Good. You took the prerequisite. Subtract 35 from both sides. In other words, x is what? 50 minus. See, Yowzi, see, this is what you did. This is really what you did. And what is that? 15%. Is that right? So, in other words, you're right. That missing tail is exactly what? 15%, yes. And this is special. This is known as a, is that on the right side or the left side? This is known as a right tail. First of all, because it's a tail, it's thought of as a tail of the bell, and it's on the right side. And yes, you, you, if you want to ever figure that out, you do exactly what Yaozi said, and you do it forever. It's no different. If this was 40, what would the right tail be? If this, if this region here is 40, 10. If it was 25, if it was uh, 12, 38, 38. 50 minus 12 is 38. See what I'm saying? This is how you compute a right tail forever. You do it now, you do it later, you do it forever. OK, what about this? See if you're really awake. Hmm. Mm hmm. 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 This is going to be a left tail. Hmm. This is now rocket science. We said this portion here is 40.3 percent. Could you tell me what percent of the bell is shaded? How did you figure that out? 50 minus 9.7 percent is what? What is that? Oh, sorry. 50 minus 40.3 is what? 9.7, good. Is that easy? Okay, let's see if you're really awake. This, is, this stuff is just way too easy. Mm-hmm.
What's it going to be, Adriana? Well, what, what's the question? What percent of the bell is shaded? What is it? What do you think? What would you do? The question is, what percent of the bell is shaded? This is 100%. What is this 35% referring to? What is it pointing to? The right side of the bell from, the, from mu to some value here. What are the 40.3 referring to? The left side of the bell, mu to some other value here. So what percent of the bell do you think would be shaded? What is it? 70 point, is it what? How did you find that answer? 40.3 plus 35 is 75.3%. Try not to. I would suggest this. Some people want to come up with some rules for when they add or when they subtract. They want a rule. When do I add? When do I subtract? They want to oversimplify this. Oversimplify. I say this to you. You deduce the answer. That will tell you whether you add or subtract. And then you go, well, well what do you mean? Well, if this is 35%, the whole thing is 50, you do what Yowzi did. She deduced the answer. 50 minus the 35. You see what I'm saying? If it's a left tail, same thing. If it is what you see here, how do you find the total shaded area? Isn't it true if you add the left side plus the right side, you get the what? Total? Does anybody here keep money in their right pocket and their left pocket? <laughs> no? Yeah, sometimes we do that, right? It's probably more likely to be a guy. Sometimes I got change in my left pocket and I got bills in my right pocket. You guys know what I'm saying? It just happens. Well, if somebody were to ask me this question, how much money do you have? Right? How much do you have? I got $40.30 in my left pocket. I got 35 bucks in my right pocket. What am I going to answer? $75. Exactly. You see what I'm saying? How much you have on the right plus how much you have on the left, that's how much you have. It's just that simple. It's deduction. You see what I mean? Is that too simple or too easy? Then why do people miss it? All right, here we go. You ready? We have some more to look at. See if you're really awake. I mean, I think that a lot of this stuff is really simple. It's just a matter of you following up, going home and practicing. That's all it is. That's all it is. You may say, well, there's so much to do at home, right? You get on what? You'd rather do this, you'd rather do that. But when you're a student, when you're a student, what's the story? All you do is this stuff. You have the rest of your life to go to the beach. <laughs> You can go to the beach for the rest of your life. But at, when you're a student, don't go to the beach. This is what you do. <laughs>